of Razor's Edge for Rookies. In this tip of the week, I'm going to cover the city field. Now, if you're like me, uh, every time you're adding a new individual or an organization, you probably get frustrated every time you have to add an address. As you're putting in the information, you always get to that city field and you have to type out the whole name of the city. And now if you live in, say, a city like Honolulu or San Francisco or Los Angeles or heaven forbid, something very complicated like Albuquerque, what you'll find is that if you've had temps or anybody that's putting in this data, a lot of times they're misspelling the word or they're just getting frustrated because they have to type out this very, very long city name. Well, what I'm going to do is teach you how to turn this text field into a lookup table. Okay, so I've opened up my sample database to show you this demonstration. On the left hand side where you're going to go is down to this module. It's the config module and when you click config, the second column over, you want to pick fields. You see that? When you pick fields, look in the next column and go to where it says address. And when you highlight address, the <coughs> field option box is going to populate and it's going to show you all the fields that you ever fill in when you're adding an address. And <coughs> if you come down to here where it says city, you see that row, look to the right, you'll see three check boxes. One says required, one says hidden, and one says look up. And when I choose this to say look up, I'll get this dialog. Do you wish to create a table for the city field? I would say yes and voila. Now I've just made life a lot easier when I'm adding a new record. And let me show you how this works. So if I go back to records and I say new individual. Now just for this demonstration I'm going to put in John Doe. So I'll say Doe, John, and I'm going to give him a bogus address right now. One, two, three, Main Street. But watch this. When I get to the city field if the city was Los Angeles, I could just start typing the letters. Look what happens. See how it populates? Just like any other table in your database, it will automatically fill out the database. And the same thing, any city that you currently have in there, there's Sacramento, there's San Antonio, there's San Francisco. You see how it works? It becomes a real fast time saver. And this also cuts down on errors like typos. So no longer we have people spelling San Francisco multiple ways. All right. I hope that tip helped you. And it, remember, anytime you need any Razor's Edge training, check us out at razorsedgeforrookies.com. Take care.